Orchard Park New York coming to you live everyone has brought their raincoats for this one as the Broncos get set to take on the Bills and the captains are out there ready for the coin toss. Lined up for the kickoff, so let's get today's game started. The Dell is just about ready to kick this one away. Marshall back deep to return. From the five. Kick They're ready to call their first yards. play of the game. Marshall on the return. The Bills line up in a 4-3. Comes up to make the play at the 29. You'll see him do that kind of thing a lot. As a quarterback, you want to make your pre-snap read. If you see him walking guys up to the line, you should audible to some kind of slant or quick out to take advantage. Here we go. Play football. Hey, watch the ball. Looking upfield. Blue down, blue down. And this defense does what it takes to bring down the quarterback. They've got the outside rush, the inside rush, they have all the right moves. The Bills line up in a 4-3. Stepping up. Hey, the defense works best when it gets pressure on the quarterback from their down linemen. When they do that, then they're more able to free up the linebackers and make plays like that. Sauerbrunn will come in now to punt it away. Harris sets up, waiting for the punt. This one goes out of bounds. Ball at about midfield. Denver goes with a four-man front. Going to the air on first down. With the throw, the wide receiver has it. Bailey is there on the right. stop. That's a 37-yard run. And he has such a quick release, and the ball is out before anybody First knows what's happening. That makes ball it hard for him to be sacked, and it gives the defenders less time to react. Let's go, Dean, let's go. Denver using three linebackers. Hands it off to the back. Foxworth with the tackle at the 16. Beautiful run there. You know, that's exactly how you handle a team that likes to blitz. You run the ball right at him, right there, and then right through him. Lynch, the lone back. Pass play here on first down. Going long. He was pressured as the defense forced the issue. Yeah, and that's something the defensive coordinator mentioned in practice this week. Making the quarterback throw the ball before he's ready to throw it. Dropping back. Gets the pass on. This pass is incomplete. And he put his helmet in there, and he made contact with the ball. Lynch with the coverage. Ball on the 16-yard line. Denver lines up in a 4-3. Hands it off to the back. Running with a lot of room. And no score. Touchdown. They run it in on third down. Comes in for the extra point. The extra point is good. good. Buffalo has a one touchdown lead now. Buffalo has lined up for the kickoff. Marshall back deep to return. He kicks a low line drive. This one is handled by Marshall. 
It's still very early, but this is one of those spots where you'd like to be able to respond and put the ball in the end zone. First, First and 10. Ball on the 27 yard line. Keep moving. I can do it, man. Let's go. Let's go. Buffalo lines up in a 4 3. Hey, watch that screen. Be careful. From the start, from the start. Buses in left. And he's forced out of bounds at the 42 yard line. A 15 yard gain right there. First, First and 10. ten. Ball on the 42 yard line. Let's go. Buffalo using three linebackers. Blitz is coming. Sends this pass out of play. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Second, it's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 42 yard line. Blue there, blue there. All right, let's go. Let's go, blue. The Bills line up in a 4 3, throwing it away. He couldn't find a receiver, so he threw it where no Third one could get. Ball on their own Ball 42. On the 42 yard line. Yeah, go. Keep it up. Here we go. Stay Buffalo down, lines down. up in a 4 3. Alexander yeah, comes see. in motion. Here comes the play. Gets rid of it. He was tipped. And That's just the kind of play they've come to expect from him. He always seems to make a big play just when they need him to. Marshall was the intended receiver on that play. Parrott is the deep return man. So stop this one where it went out. First and ten. Ball on the 18-yard line. Denver comes out in a 4-3. He'll pass on first down. On the run. What a catch. Holman is there for the tackle. And the 41 yard line. That was the coverage he was looking for, and he sends it deep downfield for the long completion. Ball on the 41 yard line. The Broncos with a four man front. Blitz is coming. Going deep. He read the single coverage and went for it all on first down. Second to ten. Ball on the 41 yard line. Let's go, D. Let's go. The Broncos line up at 4 3. Throwing. Three from the wide receiver. The Broncos pick up the fumble. The defense came up with that one. They're going to review it, and this one might get reversed. And we'll take a few looks to determine whether the ball came out before the knee was down. The key thing here is that the ball started to come out before his knee was down. If it did, then it should be counted as a fumble. Second and The ruling on the field stands. There was a fumble on the play. Clearly, the coach thought it could have been reversed, but it didn't turn out that way. That's one of those calls where you just want to be sure the officials made the right call in the field. He didn't get overturned. The coach has to feel better now that he knows it wasn't a bad call. Buffalo using three linebackers. To the counter play. Number 52 is there on the stop. Henry, on the Henry takes the handoff on the counter, picking up five. It's second down and five to go. Ball on the 34 yard line. He's turning it up. The Bills with a four man front. Number six with a man in motion. Let's go. Be still. Hey, let's go. Looking upfield. Ellison comes up to make the play. At the 38 yard line. And rumbles forward for a gain of four. Third and one coming up on this play. Here we go, baby. Receives the handoff. Pressure. 
bringing extra guys really puts pressure on the offense. You got to make your reads and get the ball out of there. You got to do it fast, or you're going to end up with plays like that. Nothing happening for the offense. They're forced into a three and out. So the punt goes out of bounds. Ball, Ball on their own 38. Ball on the 38 yard line. Let's go now. Only one man in the backfield. Looking to run it here. Great play in the backfield. Run the hard line. The interior lineman John got off the ball very well on that play. And the key to stopping that kind of run is exactly that. Whoever fires off the line faster and gets better leverage is going to win those battles at the line. Denver goes with a four-man front. Over to the halfback. Moss is there for the tacker at the 37-yard line. They might not be busting off big games, but those linemen are really working hard down there. Coming back to finish play. Drops back. Gets rid of it. Ball loose. The Broncos pick up the fumble. He never had a good handle on that thing. A lot of guys will wear gloves to help him hold on to the ball. But even if you do, you still got to wrap it up and protect it. You're going to see a lot of balls popping out like that. Everything you've got. They'll go from the I formation. Hey, watch that three. Here we go. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. With the counter play. Number 52 is there for the tackle at the 46. And rumbles forward for a gain of four. Back it up, Mike. One screen. Margo stops him for negative yardage. They wanted to pound it through the middle, but they got pounded for a loss. I'll tell you, that was a perfect time for these guys to call a blitz. They got in there, filled the gap, and brought down the back for a loss. Hey, D-line, watch the screen. Hey, hey, hey. Bell, the oh, long setback. Blitz is coming. And this pass is complete. The 30. The 20. The 10. Five. Touchdown. That's down. He does a terrific job of maneuvering his way through the secondary and all the way to the end zone. Jason Elam will attempt the extra point that would tie this game up. The extra point attempt is good. They did everything they had to on that one. The end result is a trip across the goal line and a TD on the board. At the end of the first quarter, we're all even. Buffalo, seven. Then seven. And we're ready to start the second quarter. Elam in to kick this one off. Thomas back deep to return. Nice kick. Plenty of distance. This one is fielded by Thomas. Thomas returns this one to the 16. First and 10. Ball on the 16 yard line. Will, Will, Will. Only one man in the backfield. We're talking about green. Blue down, blue down. Don't make a play. Going to the air on first down. Deep throw. Can't stay inbound. You know, as a receiver, you have to be aware of so many things. Where the first down marker is. Where the defenders are. And where the sideline is as you stretch out to make that catch. Price was his intended target. Gets the pass off. Holman comes up to make the play. Pass the 37 yard line. He gets the first down reception and then some. Ball on their own 37. Ball on the 37 yard line. From the start, from the start. The Broncos come out in the 4 3. Let's go, let's go. Give it to the halfback. Bailey is there on the stop. A big part of this guy's running style is to use the blockers to set up his cut. But they were nowhere to be found on that run. Lynch, the lone back. 
Lead off to the tail. Moss is there for the tackle on the carry. Of 41. Nothing dazzling there as they call the same running play twice in a row. Ball on the 41 yard line. Lynch, the lone back. Throwing on the run. Jumps up and comes down with it. Foxworth yeah, is there on the stop. Lee Evans makes a very difficult catch to secure the first down. When you go up like that, coming down with it is usually not much fun, especially right, when you've got ten. guys nearby oh, who are waiting to put a lick on them. Here we go. Play hard and fast, baby. Yeah. Denver goes Let's with go. a four man front. Keep the throttle down. Here we come. They soft, man. Come on. Oh. On the ground. Moss is there for the tackle at the 33. It's important to pound the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they're going to bend. Watch out. Denver lines up in a 4 3. So low. So low. Here comes the blitz. Gets the pass off. With the adjustment. He has so they're able to pick up another first down. This offense is clicking. The they're making the right calls at the right time. Ball on the 17 yard line. Nothing. They don't get nothing. The last time they were inside the 20, they got a touchdown out of it. Looking long down the right side of the field. Inches from the touchdown. The receiver just had too much momentum going, and he couldn't get himself under control. And drag his feet to get the score. All right, let's go. Yeah. Everything you got. Watch the left down. Give it to the handback. Lynch is there on the stop Lynch. at the five yard line. Gain of 12 on the play. Five, five yards ball. away from the end zone. On the five yard line. Under 10, 10. Play hard and fast, baby. Yeah. With the carry, Engelberger comes up to make the play. At the six. First and goal, they can't get into the end zone. It's second and goal at the six-yard line. The Broncos come out in a 4-3. Hand it off. Setting up play action. Throws on the run. Touchdown, Bill. Edwards delivers it for six points. Comes in to attempt the point after. The extra point attempt is good. Give some credit to that big offensive line. Those guys are working hard out there, and it's showing on drives like that. Marshall back deep to return. Kicks a line drive. Not a good kick. And it'll cost them. Timeouts, number nine. First down. Penalties and takeaways are just as big a factor in some games as effective First offense. Ten. The team that Ball stays mistake free usually wins Take the game. Side. Here I go. So we gonna take it. Watch your eyes. Hey, watch the screen. Hey, watch that screen. They saw man. The rush is on. He can't escape. Eight Eight minutes. Minutes. Hey, can you think That's about the guys, the the guys, the guys who have a big awesome. heart? Four. This guy has to be at the top of the list. He just never lets up out there. Two minute warning oh, coming up. Get some slack going. I'm coming through, baby. Stay at home. Let's go. Here they come. Two straight sacks, John. Yeah, they did a good job of getting upfield and taking them down. They ain't got enough. let's go. Let's go, dude. Buffalo using three linebackers. This one falls incomplete. Good defense and three and out series are the way to keep your defense fresh and rested. Nothing happening on that drive and they'll punt it away. From the 17, the 30. He provides a real spark with that return, bringing it back to the 42. Be efficient here. You can't afford to let time slip away from 10. 
ball on the 42-yard line. I can do it, man. Watch the man. Check it. Check They're it, trying man. to spread out the defense Get with five up. wide receivers. Blitz is coming. Throwing. Incomplete. Another incompletion because of the rain, John. So how do the players adjust for conditions like this? Well, the first thing you want to do is keep the ball as dry as you possibly can. Maybe you use a little more clock in your possession. Maybe you run it a few more times. But I really don't think it will change your game plan all that much. I know they didn't get much. But it's all about making the defense respect the fact that you're willing to run. Third base with a long third All down play here. Yard. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. The Broncos come out in a nickel pack. Here comes the play. Gets rid of it. This one falls incomplete. Good call by the defense as they set the corner on a play. He just had too much pressure in his face to see anything. And he threw one out there. Lucky for him, it wasn't picked off. So instead of the special teams group, they're going to let the offense stay out of the field and take a shot on fourth down. Drops back, throwing. Right on target to the wide receiver. Moss is there for the tackle. The defense thought they could get off the field, but they couldn't make the stop on fourth down. Yeah, they were picked apart pretty badly right there. Denver goes with a four-man front. Hey, let's go. Let's turn it up, D. They give it to the halfback. Holman is there on the stop at the 41 yard line. The defense can't afford to take too many gambles by going for a pick when they should just try and knock it down. One mistake could lead to a big play for the offense. The Broncos come out in a 4 3. Gets rid of it. Lynch is there for the tackle at the 31 yard line. John, he's proven he's a consistent partner. Yeah, especially in situations where they're looking to get first down yardage. On the count. Webster is there on the stunt at the 29-yard line. When you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense on. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing game. Lynch, the lone back. It's go time, baby. Left, left. Hand off to the tailback. Ferguson is there for the Lynn. tackle. On the run. He's showing good patience and vision in this one. Play. I'm guessing that they're going to just keep giving him the ball. The, the Bills call a timeout. They have one remaining. Ryan Lindell lines up to attempt will be about a 40-yard field goal. Well, that really is Going into halftime, the score is 17-7. Bill. 17, the Broncos, 7. We're ready to begin the Elam comes in to kick play. off. Sends it sailing. This one is handled by Thomas. Buffalo already leading in this one. Sends their offensive unit back onto the field. First, First and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Denver using three linebackers. Hand it off. Webster is there for the tackle at the 26. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. you got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the open. Only one man in the backfield. With the pass, a little off target, but caught. Ferguson comes up to make the play. At the 37. Nice ball going to the air, and that'll move the chain. First and 10. Ball on the 37 yard line. Let's go now. Blue there, blue there. Set. 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 Set.
You're going to spot this one. At the 41. He makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. Only one man in the backfield. The blitz is on. With the throw, hits his tight end who's wide open. Foxworth is there on the stop at the 47 yard line. He recognizes the blitz and gets the ball out for a first down. Yeah, and he saw a good matchup. He made a heck of a throw to get the ball to his receiver. Ball of the 47 yard Denver comes out in a 4-3. All on us, y'all. Takes it away. Tinley comes up to make the Lynch. play with the 42-yard line. Lynch with a nice burst the through the middle that time. Five-yard pickup. Second and five. Ball on the 42-yard line. Go low. Go low. Blitz is coming. With the throw, nobody picks up the tight end. And he slips out of bounds at the 28 yard line. Good toe dance on the sideline as he catches it and is able to stay inbound. First down. It's first and 10. The Broncos come out in a 4 3. Is there for when, the tackle on the carry. When he sees no something game, open to the, the inside, play. he has to take it. This defense has a lot of those quick linebackers right, and safety. And that makes it Ball very difficult to run to the line. outside against them. The Broncos with a oh, four-man yeah, front. Come on. Ha, uh, throws on the move. Jefferson, he has it. Bailey is there on the stop. That's the the defense. Defense. On the defense. Defense. On the this one I think is First on the down. defense. This is where it really counts. Use your best play and put the ball in there. First Ninth play of this drive. In today's offense, it's more important than ever that these receivers to make something happen after they catch the ball. Short passes can turn into long games when you have guys that can really fly. He's there for the tackle. Now the 16. Trying to find something in the middle. Nothing open. I'll tell you, the guys up front got outworked on that one. They got knocked off the line and they never recovered. Dropping back. Goes to the end zone. Gets his hand up. Pass interference on the defense. On the 52. First down. That penalty hurts. Not only does the offense get great field position, but they get four tries to put it in there. It's first and goal at the one. Let's go, boys. Hold the up. Trying to sneak it. And he gets in there. Touchdown. What they did there was just overpower that defensive line. They got off the ball quickly and with some power. They got him in for the score. Mandel comes in for the extra point. The point after is good. Lynch was the key man on that drive, getting a lot of big yardage. He's a very tough runner to bring down. And when he gets those legs pumping and gets that kind of blocking, it signals a long drive for the defense. Marshall back deep to return. Low line drive. From the 11. The Broncos face an uphill battle as they begin this drive at the 28-yard line. The Broncos will start the drive at the 28-yard line. First and 10. They'll go from the I formation. Danny, Danny, Danny. Let's go, let's go. Right up to the tailback. The back breaks free. The 40. The game makes the stop at the 49 yard line. And that was the perfect goal against the Blitz. Yeah, and the way to calm down a pass rush always has been to run right out. That time, they ran right past it. Buffalo lines up in a 4 3. Everything you've got. Well, in this direction. Is there on the stop at the 48. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. 
Ball on the 48 yard line. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Here we go. From the gun. Watch this. Keep the throttle down. Pressure coming with the throw. Picked off. I'll tell you, it's very important to have pressure on the quarterback. What that does is make the secondary job a heck of a lot easier. And on that play, it led to an interception. The offense gets ready to go following the interception. One of us will make a play. Make the long back. And let's go. Go low! Go low! Let's go! Go low! Go low! the handback. Drop in the backfield. Land for a short ball carrier. He didn't hit the hole with much conviction on that one. Ball on their own 44. Ball on the 44 yard Bring it up! Bring it up! Denver comes out in a 4 3. Looking to run it here. Webster is there on the slant at the 48. This team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass play. Ball on their own 48. The lineup of six defensive backs. Drops back. Gets the pass off. He hits his receiver. Champ makes the tackle. And so that's number six. They complete the pass for a first down. And they did it against the cover, too. The quarterback found a soft spot, and he got it in there. Ball on the 44 yard Length the long back with the carry. Ferguson is there on the stop at the 36. He shouldn't have much trouble reaching 100 yard mark in this one. Second and two. Ball on the 36 yard line. Hey, let's go. The Broncos come out in a 4 3. On the carry. Goal is there for the clinical with at the 31. That's some good stuff right there. You give it to your back, have a ball straight ahead for good yardage, and you get a new set of downs to work with. Ball on the 31 yard line. Ball on the 31 yard line. The Broncos with a four man front. You can't stop me. One back. Do something, do something. The carry it. Was in on the play again for another tick on the stat sheet. Tries to wriggle away, but he stopped for a loss. The offensive line just didn't get any push. He can do a better job knocking those guys off the line. No stop, no stop that motor. Then we're using three linebackers. Hand off to the tailback. Lynch is there on the stop at the 28 yard line. Five yards. With a nice first through the middle that time. Five yard pickup. We've completed three quarters of play, quarter, and the score is 24 is to 7. Bills. Denver. Denver. Seven. Denver uh, needs to play a perfect a fourth begin. quarter if they're going to make a game here. Third and seven. Eighth play of this drive. Yard line. Stay home. Hey, let's go. What's the hard count? The defense lines up in the nickel. Uh, give it to the halfback. Kelly is there for the tackle at the 19. That will keep the chains moving. Yeah, and that makes two times in this drive they've given up the first down on third down. As a defensive coordinator, giving up those types of yards will drive you absolutely nuts. And over the hill, Holden comes up to make the play. At the 19-yard line, no gain on that play as the linebacker slipped in almost unnoticed. Yeah, he did a great job getting in there. He was looking for a run before they even snapped the ball. They have a big, big lead, and they're on the move again inside the 20. Watch screen. Let's go. Hey, watch the screen. Come on. Hey, let's go one deep. Hand it off to the back. And he's there for the tackle. He eclipses the 100-yard mark on that carry. 11th play of this drive. Down inside the 15. Will, Will, Will. And we can attribute this lead to their ability to convert on third down. Hey, watch that screen. Is there on the stop at the 15 yard line? Nothing doing on that running play, so they'll probably send in the kicker. I think so. When you've got the lead, you don't have to try anything fancy. You just tap on the three and put the game in your defense's hand. The try is good. They're up by 20 now, following the field goal.
Ryan Lindell. He's just about ready to kick this one away. This one is fielded by Marshall. They need one quick score and then some more. Marshall on the return. Boom! This defense will stop him for sure. The Broncos will start the drive at the 30-yard line. First and 10. The Bills come out in a 4-3. Let's go! It's the call. Taken down to the backfield. The offensive line didn't get much of a push on that play, and the runner is stuck. As soon as he got the ball, there was a defender in his face to knock him down. Ball on their own 26. 26-yard line. Let's go now. Hey, what's the counter? Buffalo lines up in a 4 3. Closing in. What an impact. Number six gets dropped for a sack. And the quarterback continues to take tremendous punishment. They're looking now at third and long after the sack. Buffalo using three linebackers. Here comes the play. With the throw, picked off. It's intercepted. The 20. You Not a wise decision to throw that ball. First it's first and goal at the seven-yard line. Denver comes out in a 4-3. All right, let's go. Hand it off. Hurdles in the back. Lynch is there on the slap at the four-yard line. Gain of two on the play. It's second and goal at the four. Left, left. Set. And for the tailback, Webster comes up to make the play at the five. loss on the play. It's third and goal at the five-yard line. Here are the numbers when it comes to third down conversions. Consistent success on third down, which they've had, usually translates into a win. Hand it off. Touchdown, Bill. Link runs it into the end zone for the second time. comes in to attempt the point after. The extra point attempt is good. The Bills have it all working now as they continue to expand their lead. Buffalo is lined up for the kickoff. Marshall back to return. From the four-yard line. It sure doesn't look like they're going to be able to come back in this one. But it's an issue of pride. They want to prove that they're better than they've played so far. They'll All take over over the two minute mark now. First and ten. One of us will make a play, and we're going to take it. Number six will work out of the shotgun. Let's go, boys. Going for the deep man. McGee comes up to make the play at the 40. Javon Walker nails his quarterback out by making a spectacular catch. Yep, that was an unbelievable catch. That took the ability to block out the entire field and focus on bringing him in. Passing when you are first down. Rowing gets his hand on it. And they have to go to the air because they need big plays. That's right, you got to have composure in these situations. Find your receivers who can pick up yardage after the catch. But most importantly, you have to keep the chains moving. Buffalo using three linebackers. Under pressure, can't escape. Down to ten, no answers for this defensive loss. They give up seven sacks. He's trying to hurry them back to the line. Number six with a man in motion. Not here, not there. Pressure launches this one to the left. 
This one falls incomplete. Good push by the defensive line, forcing the incomplete pass. He hung in there. He didn't really have the time that he needed to make the play. The quarterback has to know who his outlet guy is and get the ball to him when he feels that pressure coming. Sauerbrunn comes into the game for the punt. Harris into return. This one goes out of bounds. As close to perfection as possible, they'll mark it out at the one-yard line. Now the defense comes out looking to get a safety or cause some kind of turnover and get a score for themselves. Right. First and ten. Ball on the one-yard line. On the one-yard one line. line. Play hard and fast, baby. One more fast. Denver using three linebackers. Let's go. Hey, right, here we go. One back. Hands it off to the back. What a stiff one. Bailey comes up to make the play. And the five yard line. He's one of those guys who can put up 100 yards week in and week out. This has been just another day at the office for him. The Broncos line up in a 4 3. Let's go, boys. Hands off to the tailback. They're going to spot this one at the nine. He laid a good hit on him there. He reported his eighth tackle of the game. Keeping it on the ground, they chose to run the same exact play, not even a shift in their formation. They've executed very well on third down so far, and that's a big reason why they're ahead at the moment. Let's go. Here we go. Left, left. it off to the back. Lester brings him down, but they get enough to move the chains. He lowers his shoulder and powers his way to the first. I can do it, baby. Don't stop. Don't stop that motor. Be careful. There you go, Spence. Huh? He'll just take him in. This game is presented by the authority of the National Football League and EA Sports. The publication rebroadcast or other use of the descriptions and accounts of this game without the express written permission of EA Sports is prohibited. This is Al Michaels. Good night.